Hey, Sheik's team, I want to congratulate you with the reviews that you have on this listing. I know how competitive Sheets can be on Amazon. So to see the rating you have, the star rating that you have is really a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a large module which you have for this listing, but you're not using it. And it takes up really valuable space. In addition to a few other things I noticed, my name is Sean and I'm an account executive with my Amazon. Amazon guy. So listen, I'll pack this full of valuable information. It's designed to help grow sales. I'll get through the module in just a minute. But the first thing I want to review with you are keywords. Now we utilize this tool to look at sponsored and organic keywords. We do a ton of competitive research and other things with this tool. So looking here, you've got 1300 sponsored keywords, 5600 organic keywords. Um, so you've got a good amount of keywords. I'm curious when you an um, had an analysis done on your keywords last, a keyword gap analysis, when you negated any of the negative PPC keywords that you have. Just curious about that. Also, when you updated your organics last, because I do think there's a lot of room for improvement there. So I want to show you some things. Um, by the way, we recommend a one to two ratio uh, between sponsored to organic. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic. But let me show you some things. As we scroll down here, Notice that I sorted the keywords by the most searched. So queen sheet set, king size sheets, bed sheets, sheets, David. And then over here in this column is your sponsored rank. Far right is your organic rank. Now, um, if you don't see a number, it means that these words are very relevant to your product, but you're not indexing for them. So right away, I see room for more exposure that we could get you. Additionally, look at your organic rank. Did you know that 90% of all clicks happen on page one? In order for you to be on page one, you need to be ranked in spots one through 50. And do you see how you're not on page one with many of your, the top 150 organic keywords? Here we go, they're sheiks. All right, that's you. You should be ranked one there. But watch this. I mean, look, you're still in the triple digits with a lot of these. And I wanna show you something. This is really, really compelling. Look at this right here. Cool sheets for hot sleepers, exactly what your product is, right? You are organically ranked 120 and there are 2,200 people looking for cool sheets for hot sleepers on the US marketplace on Amazon. And look how much revenue has been earned by sellers through indexing for cool sheets for hot sleepers. Now, you are organically ranked 120, right? But unfortunately, that rank wasn't good enough for you to earn any of this revenue. Um, I looked and Sheik's did not index. And so you've got to ask yourself, is that rank good enough? No, it should be much, much better, especially when there are sellers that are getting seven figures each month from one ASIN, right? So something to think about there, your keywords definitely need updating. Now, speaking of competition and keywords, now I found this listing by taking the words cooling sheets uh, from your listing and found this one here. Now, I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is really interesting. I know there's a slight price difference. I believe you're 185 and these are 149, but here's where it's really interesting. Look at this. They're doing it right with their keywords. They've got almost 3,000 sponsored keywords, 8,500 organic keywords. Just the organics alone are giving them a ton of exposure that you otherwise are not receiving. So think about this. They've got 3,000 more organic keywords than you and over 1,000 more sponsored keywords than you do. Um, they're showing up in over 10,000 different search variations and you're at 6,700. One other point to point out, they've sold over 2,200 units in the past 30 days. So their advertising plan is working for them. Um, cool sheets for hot sleepers, something to think about there. Now let's talk about organics. So here at my Amazon guy, we have the industry's best four phase SEO process for Amazon. And in phase three, three, we look at those keywords where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50 organically. So you're at the bottom of page one. Right now, 10% of your keywords are like that, right? So you've got 585. In our SEO process phase three, we would work to lift you up in the ranks so that instead of being in spot 49 for bed sheets 
or 27 for sheet sets or any of these where you're ranked 20 through 50, we would move you up into the top 10. And if you're not having to sponsor those words any longer, imagine the impact on your tacos. So something to think about there. Now let's go through your listing. I'm going to go through your images first and then we'll go through and I'll show you that module. So first image is good. These are okay. Very, very similar. Okay, it is, I will tell you, it's hard to read this. It's very small. This is hard to read, very hard to read. Um, I will point that out. A couple of these images, I would make some updates. The other thing I'm noticing is who is your demographic? Absolutely need to see people in your pictures. It cr creates a connection with consumers when they're buying a consumer product. So definitely something to think about, you know, a picture like this laying on the bed or laying on the sheets. That is a compelling picture. Even someone sitting in the bed, putting their hands on the soft sheet. That is a compelling picture too as well. My apologies. Now your title should be closer to 200 characters and it looks like you've got maybe about 140 in there right now. Yeah, you've got 150. So you can add another 50 characters. Now your bullet points down here, these should each, your title and your bullets should be updated every now and then. Definitely your bullets, 250 characters, and you want to make sure that you integrate those frequently searched keywords. Now, let me show you this module. So if you do anything today, please log into Seller Central. Right above product description, you'll see a brand story. Um, I'm just going to look and see. I don't think that they have it. No, they don't. But I am going to show you a sample of one. This is our founder's brand, Stephen. And the brand name is Age of Sage. As we scroll down, look at this. You've got all the, the sponsored listings. But then this Age of Sage brand just really zeroes out the noise from the competition. Plus, it's a carousel. You can put a ton of hyperlinks in here as well for noteworthy products. The crawlable text index is for organic traffic. This is absolutely the best module that Amazon has come out with for brand registered sellers. And with all of the sponsored listings that people can put all over your ad, please, please do this. Uh, your product description, I'm just gonna look at your alt text behind your images. Please add some more content to your alt text. You can have a hundred characters in each line. These are very valuable spots for SEO. Um, you've got some good stuff there. Keywords, 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 and then 500 to 1,000 words of crawlable text, integrating those keywords in your A-plus content. That will help grow your organics too as well. That's something you vitally need. But listen, here at my Amazon guy, we're a full service 300 person Amazon agency and we grow sales on Amazon. We give our clients peace of mind knowing Amazon is handled so they can focus on their business. I'd love an opportunity to chat with you. So click that link in my email that reads book a call, snag yourself a free consultation. And once you do that, I'll email out the competitive analysis. But thank you so much for watching. Look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.